I'm sorry to have to tell you this, ma'am, but you have... ...a brain tumor. But I was just here for a routine rhinoplasty. <sighs> Bye, Dad. I'm headed to the store. Goodbye, dear. I got him home. Oh, who the hell are you? Did you join the gym? Oh, hi, Mom. I was wondering. Oh, oh my God! What happened to you? Were you attacked? What do you mean, dear? Jesus, sweet Jesus, what happened to you? What are you beat up to? Relax, chap. It's all part of growing younger. Grandma, Aunt Matilda's in a coma. She had a freak snow skiing accident. Well, honey, I have news in my own. I'm preggers. And don't call her grandma. Turns out, I'm not your mother. He is! Butler? is atrocious. Let's fly to Paris. Ah, <sighs> oh, we're here in Paris. And look, it's the Eiffel Tower. It's magnificent. Breathtaking. Let's go for a walk. I've made you a souffle. You're always so kind. I'll just take this back. No sense wasting. It's just, I have the worst headache. <gasps> it's a miracle. Let's fly to Istanbul to celebrate. Well, Paris is almost just as good. Listen, the money's all gone. All of it. But we've got to keep up appearances. Well, there goes your dreams of becoming the Lord's Vat. You ought to write to your friend in Rochester Manor and fill her in. With any luck, and a little rat poisoning, a lady's maid position there might be opening up soon. All right, we'll do their valet too. Anymore. You can't have him. I'm his stepsister and we're in love. <laughs> oh my god, run! It's a tsunami! I know you're back in town for a reason, and I won't rest until I find out why. have been time for a commercial break.